Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve the 0x00000001 C PFN underscore reference underscore count blue screen error that you are experiencing on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So typical culprits for this sort of error message, as with most blue screens, could be issues with the system files being corrupted outdated system files, as well as different malware or other system incompatibilities with different software you may have installed on your computer. So we should hopefully be able to resolve this issue without too much of a hassle. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in device manager, best result, should come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. You want to expand the network adapter section, double click on that. And then you want to right click on your network connection listed in here and select update driver. Select browse my computer for drivers and then select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. And then you want to just select whatever one's applicable for your device. If there's only a generic one, you can select that one if you have no other options in here. And then select next. And then once you're done with that, go ahead and close out of here. And close out of here once more. Something else we can try here too, open up the search menu, search for update, best match, should come back with settings, go ahead and open that up. Select Windows update on the left panel here, you might have to scroll down to see it, and then select check for updates over here on the right, and just go ahead and check for any available system updates. and then just download and install. Select not now if they're asking to get updates as soon as they're available. You don't necessarily have to do that. It's really not applicable for this tutorial, so I'm just going to disregard that and not really draw too much attention to that uh, prompt for this tutorial at least. So this is actually a very large update. I actually realized what this is updating for, so I'm not going to finish uh, showing the update for this. This could take some time, so I'm actually going to just close out of here. And I'm going to move on to the final option here. So check for updates, install anything that's available. Something else we can do here too, open up the search menu and type in CMD. Best result, should come back with command prompt. Right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this command prompt window, type in SFC followed by a space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to the forward slash out front. Hit enter on the keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, and once it has concluded, go ahead and close out of here, and you want to restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully this point of issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do apologize to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.